we are told the area of the entire figure below is one square unit. So that's this entire thing. Write a multiplication expression to represent the area of the striped piece. So this area right over here. So pause this video, have a go at this before we do this together. Okay, so first of all, what is a multiplication expression? Well, we're really gonna write something times something else is going to be equal to something else on top of that, a third something. So let's think about how to do this. Well, we could think about what we're multiplying on each of these sides of this square. So on the left side here, we have divided this square into one, two, three, four, five equal sections. So one way to think about it is each of these are a fifth. For example, that's a fifth, that's a fifth, that's a fifth, I guess I'll keep doing it. That's a fifth, and then that is another fifth. Five fifths is equal to whole. Now, if I look at the width up here, I have one, two, three equal sections. So I could view that as a third, this as a third, and then this as a third. And so this area, the one that's striped, that area is going to be one-fifth times one-third. One-fifth times one-third. And then what's that going to be equal to? Well, this whole thing is one square unit, and this is one of the 15 that we see. We can count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. This is one of the 15 equal areas we have here. So this is going to be one-fifteenth of the entire square. So there we have it. There's our multiplication expression. One-fifth times one-third is equal to one-fifteenth. One-fifth times one-third is equal to one-fifteenth. 